Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to show you how to connect your Sambono MT3 with DiriFit app in Android. As you can see, we already downloaded the app. You can search DiriFit or scan the QR code in the user manual. You have plenty of options to download this app. It's easier just to search as DiriFit. We have now to allow access to phone calls, take videos, location, access to storage and such on. We have three pages down below, home, device and my. At the device we have to go and bind display. MT3 is the only option that appears. Press it and now as you can see it says it's connected successfully. You can see it says MT3 connected and though time is synchronized also the Bluetooth sign is now turned blue. So as we saw in the unbox video, we show you how to connect it in the Bluetooth so you get to make phone calls and use the music control. Same option we are showing today for those who doesn't who didn't see that video. MT3 audio is the option that you are searching for in the Bluetooth. Press connect. Now we have to press pair in, in this table. Press pair and that is now it, what we need to do in both of these sites. So back at the first page, as you can see, we have the steps, statistic for steps, week, month, and year statistic. We have steps, mileage, uh, average mileage, and the average calories. We have health, heart rate, maximum, minimum. Also, we can measure it from now on. And we have the statistic as well for day, week, month, and year. Heart rate statistic, you can see we have minimum, maximum, average heart rate. Same with blood, oxygen, day, week, month, and year statistic. Also, we have maximum, minimum as well, as well as the blood pressure statistic, which are all the same. Next, we have the sleep statistic. And at the second page, we have the device that we saw when we were unboxing it. We have battery, notification, reminder, find device, shutter, alarm clock. Sanitary reminder, sleep monitoring, do not disturb, lift the wrist, brightness, dial section where we can change the faces. Here we will see how to change one. As you can see, uh, these faces are loading up. So let's wait a couple of seconds until they are loaded. And we can choose one that we think it fits the watch and we like. Let's choose this one is simple. I like simple watches small face watches and you can see now we have a brand new face watch which looks amazing so back at the menu we have the upgrades frequent frequent contact when we show you how to add contacts and we have the personal information here at the third page also we have goal weather about so guys this was all for today's video i hope you find this video interesting and helpful if you have any questions or suggestions feel free to comment down below and we will see you in the next video with another smart device.